one simple observation and you can solve this JE main problem in less than 20 seconds. A square is inscribed in following circle and one side of the square is parallel to this line y equals to x plus k. If x i y i these are the vertices of the square then we need summation x i square plus y i square. Now as you can see that for this circle the center will be at this point. Let us say if the center is at O. So the center of the circle will be at 5, 3 and the radius of this circle this will be uh, 5 square plus 3 square minus 30 so that is 2 unit right. These are the center and radius of the circle. Now here uh, one side of the square is parallel to this line y equals to x plus 3. So the general method of solving this problem will be that equation of any line parallel to y equals to x plus 3 will be y equals to x plus k. So let us say that line AB is y equals to x plus k. Now find the value of k using geometry and then once you get equation of line AB by solving its circle we can get the point of intersection and similarly you can get the, uh, get the other coordinates. But that method will require some serious calculation. So another interesting approach of solving this problem will be if you see this line y equals to x plus 3 for that line the slope is 1 right. And if slope is 1, that then it means that the line is making 45 degree with x axis. So, let us say this line AB is the line parallel to y equals to x plus 3. Then AB is making 45 with x axis. And we know that the angle between diagonal and side of a square is 45 degree. So, that means AC will be making 90 degree with x axis. That means that the diagonal AC and BD, these two are parallel to x and y axis. Um, respectively AC parallel to y axis, BD parallel to x axis. Now once you make this observation then the problem becomes very simple. Directly from geometry we can get the coordinate of these points. Coordinate of center is 5, 3, radius is 2 units. So therefore coordinate of this point A this will be 5, 1. Similarly coordinate of this point C this will be 5 and 3 plus 2 another 5. Coordinate of point B this will be 7 plus 2, 5 plus 2, 7 y coordinate will be 3 and coordinate of point D this will be uh, 5 minus 2 so that is 3 y coordinate will remain 3. So these are the coordinate of different vertices. So now you can do the calculation you can calculate summation x i y x i square plus y y i square. When you do the calculation you will find that the value of this quantity will be 152 and therefore the right answer for this problem is first option.